was going to make a leather craft video. But I've got something else I've got to show you. Um, went down to the flea market today. Made some uh, pretty good finds at the flea market. Let me show you what I got here and I'll get right back with you. Gonna be a good day at the flea market today. Gee, look at all the people today. My, my, my. Heck yeah. Yep. Went to two flea markets today. Huge ones. Let me show you what I got. I'm not going to say the best for last. I'm doing it up front. 242C. And that's all I know about it. I don't, I don't know anything about the lanterns. But uh, I think I got a good deal on this one. And uh, I'm happy, happy. I've been happy all day. The Lord's been good to me, that's all I can say. But uh, got the Coleman Globe on it. You can see no nicks or anything. There's no dents in it. And uh, <clears throat> I'd have to take the globe and stuff off, but it doesn't look like it's too dirty inside. It looks good to me. Everything works. But uh, I was very happy to get get the winner. I, I'm just I'm tickled here. But uh, got that winner. We got another winner. And we got this one. Just go back a little bit. We got this one just for the case. We got to clean it up, but uh, let me show you the lantern inside. It's the lantern inside is not much, but I wanted the case. So, real quick, let's take the lantern out here. I'll show it to you real quick. Let me put that back on. It didn't fit in there with that knob on there, and I'm sure that's not the this just for parts or whatever, but uh, got this lantern. You can't hardly turn any lantern down for five dollars, and it's got two new mantles on it. But uh, they're pretty big mantles, so like I say, I don't know anything about the lanterns. I I don't know very much about them. See this little crank right there? It doesn't work. Yeah, it works. Right there. And uh, it's got a one and off. I, I didn't have a glove, but uh, real quick, this is a uh, this is a a two seventy four. So there's the lantern that I got. Five dollars. Can't hardly turn it down. Bottom of the box, lantern case. I I think the lantern case itself is worth uh, five dollars. So um, I I could turn it down. And uh, here we go. I don't know what lantern we're gonna put in this. We're gonna try to get something in it, but uh, hold on, there's more. Oh, let me show you this real quick. I, I got a really good deal here in this plastic. Let me get them out here. So I got some butcher knives. I have, a, I have a butcher knife collection. I know, it's hard to believe. But I have a butcher knife collection. And uh, got the butcher knives today. They were like a dollar a piece. I couldn't believe it. I have paid as much as ten dollars for one like this there's another one and uh, I, I think that's stainless steel right there 
we may convert this into something else, but uh, not not these two. They're, they go into collection. Anyway, there's the butcher knife. Uh, my friend, Carolina Chris, last year, I believe it was, he had a pot with a frying pan. And the frying pan was like the lid. I found one. Reasonable. I gotta clean it up. I'm gonna show it to you. But uh and I run into one today at the flea market. Uh it was such a good price I couldn't turn it down. So let me let me get it here. So first of all, we got the uh griddle and I have one but uh, this is a Wagner 1891 model original but it's that's just not 1891 but uh it says double griddle so somebody have to show me I don't I guess I guess griddle on each, each side but uh Got that for little of nothing. I want to say it's a Wagner. Okay, here. So like I say, uh, I got to do a lot of work on it, but I got the skillet and the Dutch oven, and it's a lodge. Imagine that, a lodge. Let me show you here. I don't know if you can see it or not, but and uh, the skillet and look how cool that is I mean I, I gotta clean it up I gotta work on it found a uh, frying pan that uh, uh, I got at the meat last year from Cheesehead Chris got it out in the garage I've been working on it but uh, what to say uh, that doesn't mean anything right there I won't clean this baby up but uh I'm not sure this is exactly like the one that uh, Carolina Chris has. I know he had a nice one. He, um, if I'm not mistaken, he was roasting coffee in the in this in one of these. But anyway, I wanted to share that with you. Besides the lantern, find of the day right here. And, uh, I didn't give hardly anything for the two pieces. I was so excited when I got in the truck. You know, I was putting a seatbelt on the baby over there. Let me show you the baby one more time. The other two, the two 20As, they've been crying their eyes out ever since I brought this one home. But, uh, when I was putting a seatbelt on it, I put my cane up on the top of the truck, and Brendan and I are going down the road about 50 mile an hour, and cane come off the back of the truck. I lost it. Didn't hit anybody's car or anything, but it landed in the road. But I had to keep on going. There was like 500 trillion gazillion cars out there. Traffic. We weren't on the highway. I think we were doing about 25 or 30. That's what I think. I'll take that back. 50 miles an hour. Anyway. And then I walk with a cane. You know. You, you hit 69, 70 years old. That lower lumbar is killing you. All right, here you go. Anyway, that's all I got for you. Wanted to share that with you. I'm happy, happy. I am just, I'm happy over the lantern and the skillet. Um, and I got a, uh, I got a, a special gift from a friend. I got a, uh, I don't have it in here, but I'll try to put it in a video. I'm 
I'm going to try to make a coffee video with it, but a friend of mine gave me a, hold on, hold on, uh, it's a glass coffee pot, it's a, uh, well just hold on just a second, I'll go get it. Sorry about that, but had to go get it. My friend Chuck, that plain old Chuck YouTube, Pyrex Coffee Pot. I am happy, happy, happy. I wasn't allowed to run with the big dogs until I got one of these. All right, that other channel was Carolina Chris Outdoors. You can check both them channels out on YouTube there. Let me see. Look here. Turn around. Let me say God bless to you. God bless America. We'll catch you in the next video.